This is the outdoor sensor assembly. It provides readings for the outdoor light, outdoor temperature, and in some situations, outdoor humidity. When completely assembled, it has a sun shield, which I'm going to remove now for more clarity on the device itself. When installing the outdoor sensor assembly, it's important to follow the instructions found on the installation drawings. Be sure that you mount it on a rooftop unit that's directly above the executive controller to keep the amount of wire that you're using down to a minimum. It should be mounted onto a one inch piece of rigid with an LB connected to the rooftop unit itself. The sensor assembly should be pointed towards the north to ensure that we don't have any direct sunlight directly on the outdoor light sensor. If you're installing this in the southern hemisphere, we want to make sure that we point the entire assembly towards the south. When terminating the wiring, it's easy to get mixed up. Because all of these sensors are 4 to 20 milliamps, if you put it on the wrong terminal, you'll get a reading, but it won't be accurate. To keep from becoming confused, utilize the wire colors that are provided. When using the light sensor, remember yellow equals sunlight. That would be our light sensor. Blue, oh my gosh, I'm cold, I'm freezing up on this roof, I'm turning blue. That would be our temperature sensor. And the gray fog is made up of humidity. That would be our humidity sensor. So remember gray for humidity, blue for temperature, and yellow for sunlight.